asking what kind of returns does a typical algorithmic trader make? Um, well, it depends. Uh, we know algorithmic traders who are able to make thousands of percentages. We know algorithmic traders who have lost their shirt. So it totally depends. Uh, it's, um, uh, there's no typical answer for this. Um, it, it, as I said, it's, um, it's as much as a business. But, but yeah, I can tell you that uh, uh, the returns are relatively higher uh, in algorithmic trading. Primary reason being, it's um, it's it's opportunity driven. So you do not really take too much of market risk. If you're not taking market too much of market risk, then um, um, then it would not be. If you're not taking too much of market risk, then you are tend to uh, make more money. But the problem is in terms of scalability. So scalability as an individual level or even at as a medium sized prop level, the scalability is not really that big a concern. But uh, uh, you need to keep coming up with different strategy ideas and um, uh, different paradigms or strategies to scale to, to scale it up because the opportunities in one particular strategy would be limited. So uh, we, I knew a guy who used to have a, this strategy uh, and he used to run on one of the commodities market where he would just trade on one lot, maybe um, uh, paying for like maybe the margin is just few thousand dollars, and uh, he would actually generate a um, uh, few thousand dollars in a day itself. So, so the returns, if you see, it would be really huge. But then the problem is that his strategy was uh, um, uh, scalable only for one or two lots. It was not scalable for like say 100 lots that you would see in a fund management business. So that's the, that's there. So returns are relatively higher uh, generally. But uh, scalability can be uh, can be a concern depending on the what kind of returns you have. So to give you further um, understanding, um, so the biggest of the hedge funds or the fund management houses would have hundreds of billion dollar under their asset uh, assets under management. But uh, biggest of the hedge, uh, HFT prop shops, you will you won't have more than few billion dollars and, uh, as assets under management. And that is also one of the reasons why most of the people uh, in the HFT side or in the algorithmic trading side they do not. Uh, go into the fund management side, uh, thereby they will have to part away with 80% of their, say, approximately 80% of their profits, but rather they try to build it on a prop basis.